I'm going to offer you another prop. All right, let's get to it. You could have a March Madness midseason tournament for a cup, right? Opt okay. in, opt out. Winner would get a first round bye or a first seed. How do you feel about that? Okay, so what you mean by this pretty much is in the middle of the season in January when things are kind of slowing down in the NBA, you kind of have a, a cup that's similar to soccer style. Um, and it's opt-in, opt-out, so players can say, no, I'm not playing, I am playing, correct? Yes. Okay, and then on top of that, the winner gets a first seed or a first-round buy. Um, that's difficult for me. I would probably vote no on this, and here's my reason why. I think that that would involve teams going really hard in the first few months of the season – um, and then that team that does get that first place, whoever that is, is most likely going to take the rest of the season off and they're going to be lightly playing. So you're going to see your one seed of the NBA. Your best team is not going to be playing much. And then on top of that, having the opt in, opt out, how many star players are going to opt out? You see a bunch of star players don't even go to the Olympics anymore. And the Olympics used to be a very high praised thing. So mm -hmm. I don't agree with it. I would say no. What about Personally, you? and I know it sounds like we're just disagreeing to disagree, but I would, I would have to vote yes for this because wow, midseason tournament. I know you're worried about the level of play after, like the team that gets the first round by, but I don't think teams would slack off that much because they still want to be ready for the big tournament. Mm. But I think that this could allow them to take a little bit of time off after. But your point about the Olympics argument, I do agree with that, that there is going to be some stars that are just like, eh, I'm going to rest my body now and get ready for the playoffs and then get ready for the second half push, basically. But I'd vote yes, because that just, that sounds like such a fun time. Imagine feeling out an NBA, like what, January bracket? What do they call it? January jambalaya or something like that? I don't know what they call it, but they call it something fun. I think it'd be fun to do a little, a little bracket. I think so too. Uh, you you definitely have me in on it a little bit, but I think at the end of the day, no one is really interested in it. And I think a lot of people would be like, oh, the NBA is just trying hard to make yeah. themselves entertaining in a time where football is taking over. So I get it, but I'm still going to go no on it just because I think the more stuff you add, the more incentive it gives to players to be like, no, nah, I'm not I'm not doing that. Mm -hmm. So well, what if you did a salary bonus? That's a good idea. I think if you did that, I think a lot of people would be a lot more interested in it. I just think you have to keep the competitiveness at a high level. Yeah. And by doing this midseason tournament, I would only do this if the short in the season to 60 games passes through. If that prop passes, then yes, that's the only way I would go yes on this. But other than that, I'm going no.